What's up, y'all? So, uh, I'm back. And it's about a week. A little bit more than a week. About 10 days. Get to you later. About 10 days later, um, since my last, well, I don't know. Who cares? Who days? Whatever. Um, last time I came to you was right before community day for March. Which was Bulbasaur's as the feature Pokemon. I did go out. I was off. So I was able to actually go out and do the full three hours. Um, I joined up with some of the guys uh, in my area. Uh, there's, If you know about my area, you know that I go to two different places. Excuse me. No, I do not do drugs. But anyways, uh, two different areas. I go one to uh, Valley Ranch, which has the uh, Fry's Electronics building, which has, I believe, ten uh, Pokestops, or like eight Pokestops and two gyms. Um, the other place is Lake Carolyn, uh, which is in downtown Las Colinas. Um, so there's two different groups that I, I usually hang out with and stuff like that as far as playing Pokemon Go. This time I went to... Um, Fries, uh, figure it would be a better place than going around Lake Carolyn. Um, if I, you know, if this was the Dratini, uh, you know, community day, I would have went to Lake Carolyn because uh, Dratinis are commonly found down there, anyways. But um, so I went to Fries. Um, I'll show you know some of the footage that I recorded from that day um, at the end of this. But um, just we're just going to get into the updates and stuff like that. So. Um, Pokemon Go Community Day from March was okay, pretty good success. Um, caught, uh, let's do a stats. I did, um, I caught 133 Bulbasaur. 133 in three hours. Probably could have been more, but, um, yeah, 133. Um, eight of those were shiny. I did catch one Bulbasaur, which was at a 95.6% IV. Um, I think it was, uh, um, CP was like 904 or 704, one of those two, something like that. I just know that, um, uh, the couple of the guys like, oh, there's this, you know, 95%, 96% bubble sore over here. And I was like, oh, it's gone. And it's like, and then I realized later on, once I got home, I had already caught it. So kudos to me. And during, you know, since there's all those Pokestops around the building, we pretty much were just walking. I actually hatched a 100% Ellie Kid also. So, uh, that's cool, right? So, I got that also in there. Now, April's uh, Community Day has been announced. It will be uh, on, uh, let's see, April 15th. So, uh, two weeks. In two weeks, two weeks, because this is already the second. So, in two weeks, um, right before tax day. Yeah. Um, two weeks uh, will take place another community day. Looks like it's going to be another Sunday. Um, and it's going to feature Mareep. Some people are like, eh, Mareep, you know what I'm saying? Amphros is not a good, you know, electric type, blah, blah, blah. But a lot of people don't have a lot of, you know, they, they might have, you know, one... Amphros, because they they caught a Mareep or they hatched a Mareep, and then just you know walked it so to get the egg, the the candy to evolve it. Excuse me, I've actually caught an Amphros. As you know, I don't evolve anything unless I've already hatched it or either hatched it, caught it, or um, did a raid for it. So if I don't have it, it's because I haven't caught it first. Um, but I have, and so I have, uh, I think I have two Amphroses, um, a couple more Mareeps and stuff like that, especially from the 2Ks that I've been hatching in the last couple of weeks for this extravaganza, um, event. Actually, a couple of days. Um, so, hey, that's gonna be a good thing. Um, also during that event, we will be getting, uh, sorry, allergies were killing me this week, and they still beat me up. Uh, my eyes are sh extremely dry right now. Um, looks like... Hold on, I'll tell you exactly. 
So the other, um, of course, the three-hour lures are going to be on there. That's, I guess that's a staple also. So expect the three-hour lures um, and everything like that. So people get the lures and just lure up. Find a good spot. It's going to be April, so it's going to be a little bit warmer. Find a good park if possible. Um, it'd be a great place to find Marie and everything. Um, the bonus for this one is going to be one fourth of the egg hatch distance. One fourth. Okay, so uh, I'll put the numbers right there. I can't calculate right now. I'm not a mathematician, I was a historian. Um, the exclusive move hasn't been released yet, so we don't know exactly what the exclusive move for Mareep will be, or uh, whether it be the exclusive move for Ampros. Here's the thing, okay? Once you catch it and you find, you gotta figure out if you if you got a good IV one, um, right away, okay? And then just go ahead and evolve it, um, because you might not be able to get that. Uh, exclusive move if you wait until after the event ends. Um, as with all the events, uh, community day events, there's always been a shiny, um, and a shiny for um, Mareep and Ampros is, 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 is eh. you know, he's he's pink, eh. pink sheet. Um, I don't know how I feel about that, but hey. There you go. Um, I guess, you know, that's what you're going to look for as far as Community Day for April coming up. I'll give you an update on that, uh, what the exclusive move will be once it's released and everything like that. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Also, for results for um, Bulbasaur's uh, Community Day, um, Team Mystic beat out both of the other teams, Valor and Instinct. Once again, we've lost control of North America to Instinct. Um, Valor, uh, they, they have a stronghold down in Australia, um, so, but, you know, Mystic still is number one worldwide, so, let's get back to North America, you guys, I'm, you know, I'm Team Mystic, so let's, let's get North America back, and then we just try to conquer Australia, I don't know, um, a little update on what my, my, uh, how far I've come in the last time you saw me. Last time I had 939,892 experience. Now I am at 1,352,431. Um, I had hatched 1,062 eggs. Since then I have hatched, and now I'm at 1,098 eggs. I have walked um, before at... 1,996.7 kilometers. Now I have walked 2,021.6 kilometers. I didn't walk that much. A lot of 2Ks hatched in there, though. Um, I've caught before 14,883 Pokemon. Now I have caught 15,312 Pokemon. Um... And I evolved back then 1,118, and since then I evolved 1,179. Now I did a mass evolution of uh, Pidgeys and uh, uh, what were they called? Uh, Rattatas and stuff like that. Just getting my experience up and stuff like that. So uh, I did that. All right. So what are, what are we looking forward to now? What's coming up in the next couple? Uh, Maybe days or whatever. Actually, it's already happened. If you don't already know, well, let's get to that in a second. Let's put that to the side. All right. We haven't heard anything about Pokemon Go Fest. Last year was, you know, during the summer. We kind of already kind of knew Pokemon Go Fest was going to happen. We all got prepared for it. It was up in Chicago. I went. Video right there. Where's Pokemon Fest 2018? Will I go? I don't know. There's speculation that it might be up in Germany this time. Um, Dortmund, Germany. Um, 
could be the place for Pokemon Fest 2018, which would be pretty cool. I think I, you know, I've never been to Germany. I need to travel a little bit more, huh? I got all these benefits and I don't travel. Um, I do travel. I just don't travel as much as I, do, I should. But anyway, so, you know, we could be looking out for that. You know, Germany, Pokemon Go Fest. Huh. Uh, so what else is out there? Um, the brand new update. So I, I, I contemplated and put it in a video right on Friday, but I knew this was coming, so I just waited. And it, 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 I was going to do Saturday and then Sunday, and now it's Monday. It's been a long weekend. It's been a great weekend um, of, of new vibrance into the game. Why? Pokemon Fest, or not Pokemon Go Fest. Pokemon Go has introduced quests, or um, as they call a research. Um, so there's, uh, what's this professor's name? Uh, I, I don't remember his name. The professor in the game. Not Professor Oak from the TV series and everything, but the other professor. Willow, I don't know, one of the professors. He needs help because he's seen some strange things happening and thinks it has to be based off a of mythical Pokemon. So... There's quests you can do in the game. There's two different ones. There's a uh, there's the field quest uh, research, and then a special research. Now the field research you can do, uh, you do as many as you want, all day and then you know what I'm saying it's just keep grinding them out and everything like that. And they reward you certain different things, as in berries, revives, um, incubators. Uh, a chance to catch a, a, a Pokemon, um, uh, great balls, Pokeballs. Um, I think there's one that was an incubator or something like that. So there's different rewards coming from doing the field request, field research. So and they're pretty easy, pretty you know. Saying if you don't like it, you can you know you know trash it and then spin another Pokestop, get another field research. Uh, Activity, I guess we'll just say it. Um, right now, I have to do, I have to catch three um, Traco or Mudkips, and I have a chance to collect uh, to be able to catch a, a Pokemon. I also have to be able to catch three Oddish or Bellsprout, and that will reward me three uh, Raspberries. Who's a Shuppet? Shiny check, not a shiny. Um, so I have that. Those are the ones I'm doing right now. I have um, I have already done. Let's see, 38 of them. So I'm averaging probably like you know 12 a day um, for these, but everything like that. But with the uh, field research, you can only you can catch a stamp one a day so you can do as many as you want but your first one for the day will grant you a stamp so i have the stamps for april, march 30th 31st and april 1st i will do one later on today um to get my fourth stamp for april 2nd and then three more days there's a special um gift now it can it has been you know uh said it gives you a chance of being able to catch a legendary. So for all you those who've never been out there to do a legendary raid, go out there and do a legendary raid. If you, because there's people doing. It. But if you haven't, if you miss one, say you missed the the Zapdos raids, or maybe you never got a Zapdos, it just kept running from you. This is your chance to be able to catch a Zapdos. They're gonna pop up, or Moltres, or Articuno, or something. I think Moltres has been confirmed as one that you can actually catch. But hey, you never know. We'll see. <sniffs> Allergies are killing me. Um, but there you go. So uh, I will definitely show you guys what I get on my seventh day on everything as far as my field research. Now, 
There's another type of research, which I already said, the special research, which everybody's going crazy over. Cause it is the special research after you finish um, eight different things, and every time when you know you finish one, uh, he he don't even say his name. He gives you three things that you have to complete. Three things, all right? Um, and then you move on to the next stage. Now, there's eight of them. So, there's a total of 28 quests that you have to do in order to be able to catch Mew. That's right. I said it. Mew. You know, the other mythical Pokemon besides Mewtwo from Gen 1 that actually allow you to be able to complete Gen 1 if you have all the regionals. Um, there you go. Boom. Mew. The cute, cuddly one. Yeah. He's up there. So, once you finish all 28, uh, 28, 24, 24 tasks, you are able to catch Mew. And right now, Mew is 100% catch rate. So, all you have to do is just hit him. Just hit him. Just throw the ball at him. Hit him. Throw a pineapple area on him so you get some pineapple, some extra candy. Hit him. 100% catch rate. 100% catch rate. There you go. Um, right now, I'm on number four. And actually, um, I'm about to move over to five. So, uh, I'm going to record that real quick on there. And I'm going to show you guys me moving from four to five. And everything like that. How it works a little bit, kind of. Um, and everything like that. So... Let's, uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and do that right now. All right, so let's get the screen recorder on here right quick. Ah. Can I go back to my game, please? My phone's been acting up a lot lately. All right. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, the game's pausing. So I'm gonna pause the recording to get right back. 